kagomuch komonge gotiet ab kene boganiso anan ko kibagengeit nanan commission noto ne teleltin kaniso shege ni mone nebo ncck ako girinda in ko in community ko ko utet ne ko testai go ibe inspector general nebo motwet nebo national police service noto ko gilbert masengeli ko ngelelti maget anan ngotu tet nebo kapkirwok nebo imone ko sipke ga rebeiwot nebo ngecheret in kibagengeit nebo ncck noto ko dr john obkinde ko kamwa kole in emet ab kenya go ibe ne teleltin ngotu tet ke mitenen katiba ako mwa kole nyalu in chega tugul nyalu in chega tugul ago ne miten en kaino na tet ko ger kole kaimuch ko gochi komonut tetutik chebo kitegis maget anan ngotutik ak tilet nebo kapkirwok ne toror nebo emet if the court orders you to appear whether you are a top cop top police officer top magistrate top preacher like me i believe we must be guided and led by the law we cannot lead ourselves there must be a guiding factor. What is it that guides this nation? If it is not the law, is it a banana nation? Kenya is not. Kenya is a nation guided by law. Yes. And even the members of parliament, if it is a court issue, we want you to obey the courts. I understand that one court officer some of the seven times and every time he tells us that he's busy what business does he have that causes him to disobey the law by which he protects because police are enforcers of law now if you are an enforcer of law and you don't respect the law then you're wondering what are you enforcing so we don't bar them from coming and attending church or attending church functions but we are saying when they get an opportunity let them just do greetings and allow ourselves to bring the gospel to them.